Hi there, John here from rchelicopterfun.com. Today we're just uh, doing the uh, first startup test of this uh, Ren MW54H engine that uh, I overhauled. Uh, just got it back into the helicopter recently. Um, I'm just going to start it up, make sure everything's running, look for any funny vibrations. Uh, I'm not going to really ramp up the RPM much. Uh, rotor blades, tail rotor are off and uh, I don't want to overspeed anything so that's why this is basically just a start test make sure it's running properly um, safety glasses on all that good stuff just in case something grenades but uh, hopefully hopefully it all goes well here um, fuel valves on first thing we've got to do this thing was all apart for you know better part of a couple of months or so and there's a bunch of air in the uh, fuel line so we've got to prime that out so we're just going to uh, do that uh, when you give full throttle, uh, it turns the fuel pump on and prime these lines out. We can see this. I don't want to run it too long. Just get all the air bubbles out. There we go. So no more air bubbles in there. You don't want to run it too long. There'll be lots of fuel in the combustion chamber, assuming it even starts. Uh, so I guess here we go. Uh, ready. RPMs reading zero. And. Uh, Let's see what happens. Well, it went pretty well. There was no vibration. It felt really good. It sounded good. Quite a bit of flameage there on startup, but uh, of course that's because we were priming priming out the lines and a bunch of raw fuel was in the uh, combustion chamber. Uh, but uh, overall it's good. So uh, the next thing I'll be doing, uh, obviously I won't be videoing it or anything, but uh, we'll be, I'll be putting the blades back on probably run a couple of tanks of fuel through it just hovering it around low hovering um, just to make sure it's all good but um, it looks like the uh, Ren MW54 overhaul went off uh, without a hitch 